What's going on, everybody? Black Reality TV. Shout out to the whole LDBC, the Lions, then boxing community. So, Earl, the true Spence, um, fresh off his dominating performance against Lamont Peterson at the Barclays Center, doesn't have too long to celebrate. Uh, he will have a mandatory coming up. Uh, uh, checking out this article by ESPN, I'll put it in the description box. So, the winner of the fight between Earl Spence and Lamont Peterson uh, would have had a mandatory, would have a mandatory, excuse me, uh, against Carlos Ocampo, uh, undefeated fighter from Mexico. Uh, where the IBF rankings are set up, the the number one and the number two positions are vacant at this time. So Carlos Ocampo is the third ranked IBF contender. So they have to uh, sit down to negotiations uh, for this uh, fight that's going to be coming up soon. Uh, that the IBF is ordering uh, Earl Spence to fight is mandatory now. Uh, Earl Spence, after the fight, was calling out Keith Thurman. Uh, listening to the interview, Earl Spence uh, is really frustrated because he can't uh, he can't get the fights <laughs> that he wants to get, man, because he's just so damn good in the ring, man. And every fight that he's uh, showcasing the skills. Uh, in the ring against these guys, he's just getting better and better. I mean, I, I see the improvement in each and every fight. Uh, when he fought Kell Brook in the UK, uh, it took Earl Spence, I want to say, at least four or five rounds to get it going uh, against Kell Brook. Uh, I believe it the first, you know, the first title fight, man, you know, on a big stage, and you're in the UK, you're in the Kell Brook's backyard, and the little jitters was there uh, against. Lamont Peterson, man, he fought well off the back foot, man, coming forward, uh, pressing attack, uh, body shots, uh, vicious uppercuts, nice right right hooks. I mean, straight left hands down the pipe, looping around the guard. I mean, it was just a dominant performance. He, he could take Lamont Peterson's best shot, and like I said, he's just shaking up the whole welterweight division, man. But... uh Anyway, like I said before, man, um, he has IBF mandatory. He's probably going to get this guy out the way and looking for bigger and better things at the end of the 2018. I'm out.